Hi, Namaskara. I am Ravi Surya, a student of software testing and a practicing test engineer from Bengaluru. I wish you all a happy Thursday's day. Thank you, fellow testers, for providing me the space, time, and opportunity to share my thoughts with community on Thursday's day. On that note, my message thought line is on the mindsets we should have for testing and automation. I said mindsets and not just a mindset. So the context of uh, my mindset learning comes from uh, what I did not learn about testing and automation when I started my career. And today I, under I understand that uh, uh, if one understands these mindsets, it will ease a lot of problem in practicing testing and automation. Yes, that's, that's what I'm learning. Okay, with that, I'll take you to, uh, to testing, okay? Uh, and testing has got multiple things within it and a test is one part of testing. So for test, I understand as an exploration with the specific purpose to learn. It has got a specific intent. Right, and we can test in infinite ways. Yes, while I while we uh, know this, uh, I also understand that okay, uh, a single responsibility principle is also associated with the test. With the test, what I do. Yes, we often okay uh, hear SRP with the programming, but I have, in my practice, I see SRP associated with the test, bug reporting, and many more. And testing operate, so um, configure. Uh, operate, observe, evaluate, report. This goes in cycle, right? The same, typically, arrange, action, and assert. So we do this data, events, and much more, okay, uh, when we test. Now, the question is, are we doing it consciously? Are we associating the SRP the, to the test, what I do consciously when I, when I test? Am I uh, um, um, arranging, doing actions, and asserting its consciousness when I test? So I see when I test. And okay, the rate at which I test, okay, will be like okay, tap, 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 tap. Okay, okay, I do this test, okay, I learn, okay, next, next one. So I, I, I manage everything, okay, like means I manage, okay, what I'm, what I have to configure. Right? Now, this leads to the question, what is the structure to the test in testing that I do? So know this SRP, and second is what is the structure to the test in testing that I do? Now let us move on to automation. Automation is a necessity today in software engineering. There is no escape from it. And automation is one of the ways to test. And automation is one, one part of a test or it's a subset of a testing. Okay. It's a, a part or a subset of a testing automation. There is no um, no to it for me <laughs> from it for that. We can automate a, a, a test to some extent using automation. So we can test using automation to some extent, right? Yes. Now, like um, I said, okay, SRP uh, with the test, what I do? Now, uh, SRP with uh, the test, what I write using programming. Yes, I consciously uh, arrange uh, do my actions and assert when I write uh, my automation because I am putting my uh, consciousness into the writing those instructions in program. And those program, okay, uh, it interacts and try to uh, do this triple A for me, right? Yes, and I evaluate them. Now, what is the structure of uh, the test okay, that I do in automation? So SRP, structure. Structure of test I do okay, in testing. Structure of test okay, uh, that uh, I do with help of automation. Two things, okay? Now let me move on to um, test and automate with a, with a use case, okay? Say, so, uh, can I change the password of other users? Okay. Uh, I can test this, okay, uh, on a GUI, API, and uh, the downloads. And I can control, okay, the setup and data, and uh, I can do this, okay, uh, without uh, without uh, getting, okay, uh, disturbed or uh, without breaking my test uh, badly as I, I get in automation if I mismanage the data. Now, if I have to automate, if I have to automate the same thing uh, on a web, that's changing the, the password of other user. How? Today, okay, let's say um, if I use a, Selenium 4, and I use the network interceptor of CDP protocol. I can do that. Means I can send okay the response payload to the interface of what I want. Now, if I send that response of what I want, will the client reflect uh, the other user's uh, login or, uh, or, or my login through which I change the password? Question, right? Now, if it did change okay to the other user login, what happens to the next test? How should I enter those tests? Now, pass it. Okay, uh, let's say through UI, 
I am talking to the abstractions of uh, code written by the programmer. That's a product code abstractions. One thing. When I test, okay, why am I automation? I am writing uh, abstractions, okay, to my automation code. I am using. I am making use of uh, the other libraries. That's a uh, the, the dependency libraries, which has got abstractions. Now abstraction one, abstraction two, and combined is talking to the other uh, abstraction. That is the product code abstractions. Now you see here. To, to see this abstraction and to see okay, the structure and SRP, everything, it needs some mindset. So the mindset, okay, well, with what I go for, okay, testing as a human, I cannot apply the same thing here. I'll have to uh, think and plan well to structure my test. And then, so with that, uh, uh, this testing and automation has got a few things in similar. That is uh, intent of a test, action in test, what we assert and evaluate in test. So um, this, okay, uh, this, this similar is, makes us to believe that we can automate like we test and vice versa, but no, we can't do that, okay? And this is the first step we fall into when we start writing um, the automation or, or practicing, practicing automation. So when I started writing uh, the automation, I wrote, okay, everything on page and I ran, okay, that for overnight and it ran, but it did not scale up, okay? And uh, <laughs> I did automation like I tested, it, it did not go well, okay? So uh, I took, okay, years to learn this, Okay, uh, when I practice testing and automation. So, you know, these abstractions are limitations, abstractions are contextual, abstractions have confined coverage. So, is automation and so is our testing. Okay, but these two are different mindsets. Now, how to know these mindsets? How to how to uh, see this mental model of, model of a mindset? Simple SRP, structure of a test, of testing what I do, structure of a test, uh, what I do using automation and abstractions. Now, put that together, okay, it brings to you the abstractions layer of a um, test automation. So let me come straight into okay test lectures. Set up, tear down, and test. When I do this, okay, now I know okay abstractions and SRP for test. When I do this, okay, now I interact with the abstractions of other uh, packages or models that are right to help my automation uh, and test run right. Yes. Now, now I know the dots. Now I am okay figuring out, okay, this dot connects here, this comes here, now I'm connecting. This is what I wanted when I okay, started my, to practice testing and automation. I wanted, okay, someone to, to, to guide me this. Okay, look at it this way. This, this is how it works. If you note, uh, notice that, okay, I'm not talking about any programming. I'm talking about, okay, the mental picture of, okay, the mental mindsets, okay, that I should have, okay, before, okay, I, I start uh, writing automation with the programming language, right? Yes. So, uh, build and maintenance, okay, everything. Everything makes sense now to me, right? But we have conscious order, consciousness order. Order of what? Abstraction is how do we use them? That's some mindsets. Okay. So with that, okay, I, I will say um, we can automate to some extent like we test. We can test to some, ex some extent like we automate. But okay, but uh, we cannot okay uh, automate like we test in complete and vice versa. Okay. Know the structure of your test. Okay, know the Abstraction layers, okay? No, okay, we um, want you to have the awareness, awareness of, okay, all these things and help your, okay, intense pressures or your fellow test engineers, okay, in your org, okay, to practice and have these mindsets, right, from, okay, the day one when you start practicing a test automation and testing. This helps them, okay, to scale their work, to hire you, okay, your product and uh, business will be much, much valuable. So with that, I will say testing and automations have different mindsets. See, SRP, structure to your test of, uh, from a human, structure to your test from uh, automation, abstraction layers, okay, one layers, okay, when, when I test, and two, two and more layers, when I test through automation, how to, how to uh, uh, put, them, put them into a model and get it done and keep it running. That's two mindsets. Yeah, that's it. Have a good day.